teach you a little trick when doing a lasagna. If you take the cheese and put it in first and then mix the cheese with the sauce, it is so much easier. Come on. You didn't hear that from me. I don't think you're going to find that on YouTube anywhere or on the internet. All right, why are we doing this? It's to make our life easier. Because I'm using a sauce that's very thin in the middle, the Fra Diablo. And we want to do extra cheese. It should be three handfuls. This is eight ounces split up. Oops, some hit the table. Houston, we have a problem. And the rest in there. Obviously, we're going to take some from the left and move it over to the right because that one's been denied and my sauce is the thickest by far. Mirror, mirror on the wall. Who's the fairest of them all? I'll put just a little extra cheese and then we're going to mix this up. Now, if you're doing a lasagna and you're using what I just used, I love these things. It's shredded cheese. It's a blend of mozzarella, provolone, parmigiano, romano cheese. Uh, look at the ingredients. It's not garbage. It's okay. Fresh mozzarella is obviously better. Pure aged provolone. That's not an aged provolone. And parmesan romano. You get a parmesan and romano cheese anywhere. I have in my... Oh, I have romano cheese that's worth a lot of money in my fridge. You get a Romano cheese that is aged for decades, 10 years, 20 years. The taste is unbelievable. All right, and that's how we roll. That is taking cheese, four cheeses, and mixing it with the sauces.